COVID-19 has changed the way students learn. It's also playing a role in where prospective students decide to learn. Instead of in-person tours, Dunwoody College of Technology is offering a virtual walkthrough experience. Cindy Olson joins us this morning. She's the Vice President of Enrollment Management for the school. Good morning, Cindy. Good morning, Jennifer. Thanks for having me. Thank you so much for being with us. So how has fall recruitment been going? Fall recruitment has been going well. We're cautiously optimistic. Um, we feel confident about the safety plans and protocols that we have in place. And our students are, you know, they're very resilient and they're well aware of the essential industries that we support and they know the salaries that are waiting for them as they go through our training. And so I think that um, we're looking forward to a real robust um, experience this fall, which isn't just five weeks for us. We start on the 17th of August. Oh, wow. Well, we'll get to that in a minute. Let's talk about these virtual tours that you're giving prospective students. Yeah, yeah. So Dunwoody has been well known for years for offering hands-on education. So of course, our spaces like our shops and our labs and our studios are very important to, you know, they're a very important piece of the student experience. So when COVID hit and we lost our ability to share those spaces with our students and showcase them, we've really felt like we were missing a vital piece that students needed in order to kind of assess the fit and make sure that they were choosing, you know, the right school with the right equipment and technology that they were looking for. So we solved that challenge actually by talking with our industry partners. Um, Mortensen Construction actually um, was the one that kind of pointed us towards this Matterport um, uh, product that has just really changed the way that we've been able to do tours and really give kind of a virtual immersive experience for the, for the students. Yeah, we've been looking at video as you've been telling us this, um, and it really it kind of brings you right into that space where students would learn. You think this is an effective way to kind of show students what the program is all about without being able to come in and tour for themselves? Yeah, absolutely. And what I really like about this this product is that it even appeals to the students kind of um, mind sense and interest even as they use the tool. One of the ways you can engage with the product is kind of a dollhouse view where you can kind of take the whole kind of section of the lab and turn it on turn it around on its axis and our Bachelor of Architecture students and design students really find that kind of an appealing uh, way to view the space. We also have a floor plan view that's more of a layered approach, and that works really well, of course, in construction where you're doing a lot of blueprint work. It's very similar to that, but it also appeals to our School of Engineering sure. students and our automotive students who are used to using schematics. Yeah, and you, then, of course, there's the immersive experience as well. I mean, it's really interesting to be able to see it this way, and you offer classes for in-demand trade, so it seems like it's an important time to be able to continue to do that and to show people what's available. Absolutely, absolutely, and and we're finding that we have a, a lot of interest and a lot of support from our community. Um, we've been around for over 100 years, and we're learning to adapt along with um, everyone else around us, and we're just finding a tremendous amount of support. Wonderful. Well, thank you for showing us what you are doing to, to stay relevant and to, to show students what they can expect there at Dunwoody. Cindy, thank you for being with us this morning. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Thank you, you too. To check out Dunwoody's virtual tour or learn more about the college, we have a link at WCCO.com.